Hey guys, welcome to Adventures in Millerland, and we are at a place that we've wanted to come to for the last few years called Apple Hill. We're actually in Placerville, California, and we stayed in this hotel, Best Western Plus, here in Placerville last night. Uh, but we're headed up to Apple Hill today, which is a bunch of apple farms right on Highway 50, and we can't wait to go eat a bunch of apple fritters, donuts, pie, apple cider, everything. Apple everything, yes. <laughs> we actually got here last night and uh, went to uh, Bricks for dinner. Bricks at, on Main Street? Yeah, on da downtown in, in Placerville. It was really good. We had, I think the girls had filet medallions. Mm -hmm. We had uh, ahi salad and some, some appetizers we shared. It was really good. Yeah, it was really, really good. And if you guys are in the area here, you should definitely check it out if you're looking for a place to eat. Ask for Tyler. He was an amazing server. He yep. gave us great recommendations and it was just a really fun, delicious dinner. We're about to head up the hill. We'd love for you guys to come with us. Let's go. Hello, Mr. Bear. Is this fun? It's all sorts of apple, butter, teriyaki sauce, and they have caramel. Wow. Probably for dipping your own apples in. I was just talking to the lady who works here, and it is Friday, and she was telling me she wished we came on the weekend because they have a lot more fun things for kids, but they do have a really cool thing that you can do, which is mine for rocks, which I know is one of your favorite things is finding rocks, so I think we should definitely do that. What do you think? They have rocks that you can mine for that are from all over the world. Cool. Yeah. That one, I think, has my name on it if I was to get one, that toffee caramel apple. It has all of them. And this one looks amazing too. Chocolate fudge. I want to see what Alyssa would like the most. And probably. peanut butter fudge. Wow. What? Look what uh, Alyssa would like the most. Mud pie? Yeah, probably. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> so I know we might not get one, but I really want to get a caramel apple because I'm going to get uh, braces in like a month or so. Um, and the one that looks the most appetizing to me is the apple pie apple. It's caramel, of course, vanilla fudge, and cinnamon sugar. Oh boy. That looks, looks like so a good. churro yeah. apple pie apple. Yeah. Wow. It's delicious. I yep. really want to I, I want an apple fritter to share. It's huge. Okay. Okay. Wait, no, I want it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's good. Mm. Oh yeah. my gosh, that is heavenly. Mm. I actually think that's the best thing I ever tasted. That is delicious. Give me one. Really airy. Get that up, bite, Lindsay. Lindsay, come up for some air. Donut? <laughs> stuff in your face full of apple stuff. Oh my goodness. That's good. This is delicious. The apple part is much better. Mm -mm. So the nice thing about this before I even eat it, it's kind of warm. Yeah. So it's well, the, really the, fresh. The donut's really warm. Yeah, so it's really oh, fresh. Yeah. I'm excited about this. It's really good. Taste the donut. Wow. <laughs> so the thing I like most about the fritter it's really fresh, and it's kind of like that spongy, not cakey kind of thing, but I like it because it's not overly like oily and greasy. Yeah. That's, when you get a fritter, sometimes it can be too much. That's great. Try the donut. Let's try the donut here. Mmm. Mm. Wow. Mm-hmm. That's really good. There's not a ton of apple flavor, but it's super fresh, nice and warm, crunchy on the outside, nice and doughy in the middle. Really good. So, so far, Abel's Acres, Great, definitely didn't make this a stop if you're coming to uh, Apple Hill. But uh, I think Lydia was right. If we come on a Saturday, there's definitely a lot more here. Looks like they have like horse rides and other things that are happening that only happen on the weekends. So if you guys are coming, make sure to come to Apple's Acres. If you can come on a Saturday, do it. We wanted to avoid the crowds, which we are, <laughs> which is nice. But they said in like mid September, uh, it's not too bad. The crowds aren't too bad. The weather's really nice. So, yeah. so far, great start to the day. So we're definitely gonna get a bag of sand with some rocks in it. Alyssa is gonna sift, using the little sifter there, uh, down below. And she loves doing this stuff, as Carrie said earlier. So this will be kind of fun for her. Wow, look at this 
scratch. Oh. So if you do it. Cool. That's pretty. What do you think it is? Amethyst. Amethyst? Or a quartz. Probably rose quartz. Ooh, this one is really cool. Look at that. Ooh, that yeah. is really pretty. I like um like gold canning um because like you don't know what you're gonna find. If you get something pretty cool, then um, you can like put it on your shelf. You just like collecting rocks, so they're pretty, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. So we are now at Boa Vista Orchards and they are supposed to have really amazing apple donuts. We tried the ones at uh, the last place we were at and they were really good. So we'll see if these match up or maybe are better. A lot of vendors here on a Friday, which is great. Face painting, that's really cool. And a lot of fruit and gourds. All right, so we've got the sugar apple donut, the glazed apple donut, apple dumpling, uh, apple fritter, apple strudel. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> that will be a better breakfast because it has like, you know, it's like milk. Eating, it's, like, it's, like, it's like an apple crisp cereal because it's like milk and, you know. It's like a, it has all that calcium and, and fruit. Yeah, it's, right? like, it's got all the vitamins. I think that sounds like an amazing breakfast. I said it was twelve dollars. Got a sugar of Wow. Yeah. <laughs> twelve dollar breakfast. Not bad. Uh, now you're gonna let let us have a bite, right? Wait, we're not we're sharing. <laughs> <laughs> Following this thing to make sure it makes it to the table whole. We'll see. <laughs> Wait, no, stop! All right, we have a sugar donut and a glazed donut. And this is why we eat healthy all week long. So on the weekends, you know, have two donuts, one in each hand. All right, so I've now tried the donuts from Boa Vista where we heard they had the best donuts and we went to Able Acres earlier. I like the Able Acres donuts better. They were like really, well, they were warm. These aren't warm and they were light and airy and crisp. Oh my gosh, they were so good. These are fine, but those were delicious. So they get, we can see a apple peeler in action. See the peels right there getting peeled right off and apples coming down. That's really cool. You see the peeled apples all right there. It's fun that they make this uh, so you can see it and watch. There, she's making a ring, like for me. So it's like a customized ring. You're gonna work both of those together. Really good. So what you're gonna do is just put a little dab on the top, not too much, because we don't want it to squish out. So just a nice little dab. Like that? Yeah. Did you hear it click in there? I did. So hang on. Ooh, look at that. Very pretty, Alyssa. Mm -hmm. I am going to take another little tool, and what I do here is I'm going to smash down the side. Probably. Graham Graham here is going to get my little polishing cloth. Ooh, polishing. 20 minutes to dry. Right. You can go ahead and put it on your finger. I've squished the sides down pretty good. Is that side like a little Does it stiff? need a little bit more? I think. Push it back down, make sure it stays in there. I'm sure it won't pop out, but if it ever did, you come back and visit me, okay? Okay. Enjoy Apple Hill. All right. So Alyssa, I don't know if you can see this, got a ring at Grandma's Glass Boutique from Jennifer Duncan here at Boa Vista. Ooh, it's I think pretty. it looks like a peacock tail feather. Ooh, cool. Did you help make it? Yeah. Did you spend your own money on that? Yeah. Good, I'm glad I like you love it. Ring. At Boa Vista Farms, they have all kinds of stuff you can sample. They have a whole section where you just take all the samples you want and then you go over somewhere else and buy it. So we got some really yummy things, mostly for gifts. I'm not gonna say who they're for, but we have this bacon bourbon barbecue sauce. Really yummy unsweetened apple butter. 
and this one's for us. Apple chipotle grilling sauce, so Chris can make us some ribs. And then we tried the most delicious fresh apple cider. So good, we all got so one good. of these. Yeah. So fun to taste all those different things. So we kind of just popped into a Boa Vista. It's one of the larger ones, I think. One of the larger uh, Apple Hill orchards. But they had, uh, the donuts were good. I think we liked the other ones better at Abel Acres because they were warm and fresh, but I actually like the apple flavor on these donuts better. But they're both really good. Uh, we're gonna head over and check out the pumpkin patch they have here. We're leaving Boa Vista Farms and there's a lot to do here. A lot, lot of things to buy, tons of fruit. Um, Alyssa got that ring and Jennifer, who helped us with it, who you saw uh, just a little bit ago, Jennifer did an amazing job, really patient, really gracious and helpful, but uh, just made that experience for Alyssa so fun. Uh, Alyssa loves making jewelry. Uh, she loved it, we loved it, and uh, can't wait to check out some more farms. So we just got to High Hill Apple Farm and we're excited because this place is shady and it yeah. is hot today. So we're glad to be a little bit cooler and come see what they have here. Hopefully some barbecue. Yeah, we're looking for, for some lunch. <laughs> So like Carrie said, it's been a warm day, so if you come in September, be prepared for warm weather up here. But uh, looking forward to this place, it's definitely got more shade, lots of booths, and we'll see what they got. All pretty. kinds of succulents. Thank you. You make all of it? I do. Wow. I work the wood shop. So cool to see local artists making stuff like this, and this guy is a woodworker and makes all these frames for succulents and cactus. It's super cool. A little miniature studio. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, cool. But a lot of really great stuff here so far. Look at that. They got pony rides for the little kiddos. That's awesome. More donuts and fritters. Fudge and candy shop and caramel. Fudge factory over there. Lots of sweets. But we need real food. We're leaving High Hill Ranch. They have really cool crafts here. We didn't get anything to eat. Uh, they didn't really have anything savory. So we're gonna go back to Boa Vista Farms to get some barbecue and then head back to Abel Valley, Acres. Abel Acres to get some of the things we got uh, that we saw when we first got here. And then we're gonna head home. So we are back at Boa Vista Farms and we know they had some good food options here and they had some really good looking pie. So we're gonna get some food and I'm gonna get my mom a couple of boxes of apples because she really wants to make applesauce with apples from Apple Hill. So <laughs> we're gonna be looking for that and then we'll head back down to Abel, Abel Acres and they had some amazing looking stuff there that we wanted to get on our way out of town. So we're just gonna be stopped at I think three or four different uh, apple farms, which isn't bad, but it's a really hot day. I think if we come up here again, we're gonna come up in October where it's a little bit cooler, but so far so good. Brisket sandwiches with ooh honey habanero barbecue sauce, you, uh, apple cinnamon, and sure. apple chipotle. Yum. Question is, can I get this to our table without spilling any of it? It will be a miracle if I can get this to our seat without spilling anything, because I am one of the clumsiest people around. It's an Apple Hill miracle. Ah, never mind. I spoke too soon. <laughs> the sauce is dripped. Dang it! I almost made it. Well, it's not on your shirt yet. Don't say that. I mean, if you want a them. true miracle. That is very true. <gasps> Tell me what you think. Sweetie. I got four of those. Delicious. That looks good. Oh yeah, I think they delicious. toast the mm -hmm. bun. This meat is so tender and delicious. It is so good. Mm. We got brisket sandwiches. Really, really good. Yeah, should be a good uh, super tender and got different types of sauces here and I uh, can't wait to try them. But I tried the cinnamon. apple cinnamon, it was really good. I'm gonna try the apple chipotle. I think it's gonna be amazing. 
a little bit of kick, but it's really good. The sandwich is amazing. So we got all the apples for my mom and a few other things for us. We got some cider and other fruit. The rest is for my mom to make some applesauce, which I'm hoping to benefit from a little bit. Yeah. Back at Abel's Acres, and it feels like we've been all around this area, but we've only actually been to three apple orchards, apple farms. But uh, we came back to Abel's because some of the stuff we want to take home, like some caramel or caramel. I don't know how you say it, caramel or caramel. But uh, we also want to get some pie here, take home pie. For what? Frozen. Frozen take home pie, and maybe even some pie slices. And get some water, get a few other things. But we've really noticed a difference at Abel's Acres. It definitely feels more family run versus more of like an operation. Uh, all, the, all the farms have had great unique aspects to them, but we just really enjoyed this place the most. So uh, we are going to get a few last things here and then head home. Oh dang. I really want to try the other one first, but I'm gonna Apple go. berry. Marion berry, buttermilk. Mm, that's good ice cream. Mm, not Marion berry, it's good. It's essential. It's what? Essential. <laughs> it is essential. It's essential. Life. Okay. Heaven. He everything you could ever be. How is it, sweetie? Been. I don't know, but I can't wait. How is the Marion berry one? Oh, well, yes. okay. <clears throat> What'd you like the most? Probably the Marion berry. It was very good and, like you said, very refreshing. Um, And then. Whereas like the pecan um, caramel apple pie, it was it was really good, but I think it, I think it was just a bit too much for me. A little too sweet. Yeah. yeah. I didn't taste any pecans. I had like three or four bites, and I didn't Sad. have any pecans. It was good though. It was good. I like I like the Marion Berry a lot better. Marion yeah. Berry apple. Oh yeah. All right, we are appled out. We, <laughs> we are appled out. Yeah, we came back to uh, Abel's Acres, which was our favorite out of the, we only went to three farms, yeah. but they were all different, and I wish we could have visited more. There's so many, but um, this one was our favorite as far as just the atmosphere, the people there are really nice. People that work here are amazing, super helpful and gracious, and shared a lot of great information with us about the history of the place and how many years they've worked here. We talked to a lady over the counter that gave it, sold us our candy apples that worked here for like, what, 25, 30 years? Yeah, a long time. Yeah. And she was really friendly and nice. Yeah. And we got our frozen pies here. We tried some pie here. Um, Boa's was great for especially the barbecue and also mm -hmm. all the produce they had there. Yeah. And then High Hill had a lot of really cool crafts. Yeah. So it was fun to go to all of the places. It'd be neat to go to more, but we're tired and we're ready to go home. All right. Well, thanks for watching. And we look forward to coming back here, hopefully next year or the year after. And next year. Next year, okay. And uh, we actually think next year we might do a day trip instead of yeah. come overnight. But thanks again for watching and thanks again for following along with us. And make sure you hit subscribe and hit the notification bell so that every time we upload a new video, you get notified. Have a great week and we'll see you again soon. I'm loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here forever?